All right, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy on the Gamer Eight Seven Zero, back with another banger. Um, Want to take the advice of someone who left a comment on a previous video? They said that, "Hey, chill out with the music, man. The music ain't really what's hidden." And I thought about it. One of the things that, one of the reasons I added the music from older videos was because someone said they. They didn't care for the dead silence that was involved in the video when I would do certain things. So I don't know how to make everybody happy. I ain't got to that point yet. But however, the music annoys me too. So um, I'm going to try this one with no with no music. Let me know what you think about it. If it works for you, great. If it doesn't, I can go back and find some more music. But let me show you this team right quick. This 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 team is filthy. Okay. This team is nasty. Let me show you what I mean. All right. We are 88 overall, 88 offense, 88 defense. We have Kareem Jackson, Delta O'Neal, and Shaquille Baird as our top three. They're all 94 overalls. Um, come on. Let's let's take a, a, a good look at what this team is looking like. Um, on offense, we aren't the greatest on offense, we aren't the greatest. I have not come up with a million plus coins for Mr. Dan Marino. I just haven't. Um, yeah, that's the nicest way I can put that. I just haven't come up with a million coins, million plus coins for him. So as of now, he is a 93 overall. Um, we do have some abilities on him. At this point, now, I know you all see my training game right now. I know you all see my training game. I am getting into my buying packs and just simply putting them in training. One of the things that I did last year that helped me tremendously with my team was the ability to put abilities on everybody. I said the ability to put abilities on everybody. Yeah. Um, that helped me tremendously. It helped me with my players that help me with my playmaking so that's what I've decided to do this year one of the things that I have put on let's, let's take a look at Mr. Dan Marino forget all that let's take a look at the abilities alright the abilities that I have on my players Dan Marino has inside dead eye set feet lead and tight out some of y'all are probably wondering why in the world would you put tight out on our quarterback? And I'm going to show you why in just a moment. We have a really good we have a really good tight end in Denver right now. Um, I told you all if you go back to older videos, I told you in real life and on Madden. I said Noah Fan is going to have a breakout year. He's not necessarily having a breakout year, but he is showing that he belongs in the upper echelon of, of players. I have identifier on Gary Zimmerman. Um, that's my snitch card that tells me where you're coming from at all times because I'm about to start playing people head to head and get in some weekend league. It's October. I told you I'll probably start in October. And freight train, I'm loving the fact that I can put next to nothing into Sean Alexander and get these wonderful abilities. I have backlash and bulldozer on Sean Alexander. And I have edge protector on Mr. Ty Sambrello. Um, Sambrello, however you pronounce it, if one of those isn't correct, I apologize. But that's what we are right now in terms of Mr. Ty. Um, now, let me show you Mr. Noah Fant. Let me show you Mr. Noah Fant. Noah Fant, is, this card is unfair, y'all. Now, if you all, as you all can see, he's an 83 overall right now. But he actually hits 85 with, when, when we're all said and done. When we're all said and done, he actually hits 85. Now, Noah Fant is an 85 overall card, but he has 91 speed. 91 speed from an 85 overall card. That's filthy. That's filthy. And his strength is 72. Catching is 85. Catching traffic is 78. Short route running is 79. Mid route running is 75. Run blocking is 65. You're not getting no offense to block. You getting no offense because he got 91 speed on a full Denver Broncos theme team. Oh, okay. 
looking at that that frame coming together on on the video. Y'all see it? Y'all see it? Uh, but yeah, six four two forty nine ninety one speed. Loving it, loving it. So this is the reason that I have type out on Dan Marino, so we can get the ball to Mr. Noah Fan. Um, you all have seen the other cards. There aren't any upgrades on the oh. Have a, another um, player, Mr. David Moore. There's really no point in showing you the upgrade right now because he does not have Denver Broncos Kim, but he is another card that once he is once he's received his Broncos Kim, and he should receive it in the very near future because he played his first Bronco game this past weekend against the Ravens, which we got blown out and destroyed. Shout out to my boy. Um, I'm not even go go. No, I'm not even gonna do that. No, I was going to be real petty. Not go do it. Not go do it. Not go do it. But yeah, David Moore is going to uh, get his Broncos can and probably go up to a 90 overall. So he'll probably move into wide receiver three until I can maximize Mr. Devin Hester. All right, defense. Defense is sick, y'all. This defense is really unfair, Okay. This defense is really unfair. I've made some adjustments. Vaughn Miller is now starting middle linebacker. Shaq Baird is starting left outside linebacker. Not sure if you all were here when these other adjustments were made, but I know you weren't here when I made this one. You couldn't have been here when I made the Delta O'Neill upgrade. Um, Mr. Delta O'Neill is on the squad. 94 speed. People, we are approaching in game numbers for real with these players already. 94 speed, 95 excel, 94 agility, 90 jumping, 93 play rate, 90 man, 93 zone, 82 press. Very nice card. Very nice card. It's one of those cards that you get. You wouldn't be upset getting this one after Christmas, honestly. Um, the fact that he's already at 94 overall and we're still in October. Mm. Mm. But I do have a complaint. I do have a complaint. And it's just a complaint for the sake of complaining. But we have enough secondary people, Madden, for a while. We need some offense. Like, we need some backs. Terrell Davis would be great. Willis McGahee would be great. Clint Portis would be great. Um, I know Portis has gotten a little trouble, so he probably won't be getting the card, but we could use some of those cards. Where's Peyton Hillis? Where is Peyton Hillis? I know he's coming out because he, he was in a commercial earlier. Come on, Peyton Hillis, quit tripping. So with that in mind, though, um, let me show you these abilities. Let me show you these abilities on my players right now. And we are rocking a full defense where everybody has a star. Everybody has a star. On Delta O'Neal, he has acrobat. Shaquille Barrett has edge threat. Kareem Jackson has run stopper. He, he plays at the line of scrimmage a whole lot. So I prefer him to be there so he could do what he has to do. Get to the quarterback, basically. Uh, Cam Chancellor has run he has zone hawk on him patrick sertan has acrobat full a key to leave has acrobat aj boyer has universal coverage brian dawkins has acrobat i'm probably going to change that probably going to change that um demarcus ware has edge threat Justin Simmons has zone hawk, and Shamar Stephan has inside stuff. So all of my players that I, when I'm running one three seven, have um, an ability or a super, they have superstar ability, or they have um, whatever. They 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 all have a star underneath their feet. That's a little bit intimidating at the beginning of the game. I think my. I think that's been pointed out before. So if you aren't accustomed to it, it 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 could it could bother you a little bit. But we have five cornerbacks that are ninety and above. We have five cornerbacks that are ninety and above, and Justin Simmons is bringing up free safeties with eighty eight. 
he does play regularly. He actually starts in the defenses that I run. And Cam Chancellor is my user. So Kareem Jackson is a blitzer in, in the defenses that I run. Or he, he, I can put him in coverage. If those who don't know Kareem Jackson's secondary position, he can actually play cornerback as well. So with that in mind, you all, you all see how we coming. You see what we rocking with. We, you see that it's real out here. It is real out here. So we're doing what we have to do. It is what it is. It is what it is. So with no further ado, continue to be blessed. Continue to tell our God to use you. If nobody's told you today, I love each and every one of you, and there's nothing that you could do about it. Like the video. Like the video. Uh, give me some feedback on if you want music or not. I can do either one that you prefer. And, uh, yeah, be blessed. Peace.